Hi guys, how's it going? My name is Smooth Play. Well, now, woo, wait me a little bit. Okay, so what is your mood for today? Now, just having a little review. What's the mood of the day? Like today, do you feel really happy, really mad about something, really happy about something, really anxious about something, or really disappointed in something? Do you feel like you are having any feelings? And is there any negative feeling in your day that covers your mood? If there is, then you would maybe, yeah, just maybe, from my thinking, maybe you be like, "Ooh, I'm a bad girl, I'm a bad boy. I can't just make myself be good." It's not like impossible. I'm possible. You can do everything if you try. You can make yourself feel good without that having some motivation with any people. Okay, so there's a girl calling me, but my mom has answered it. That's a good one because I think I would need to spend for nearly flying for nearly half an hour to talk with her. So let's just. Go and scrap different things and different ways that you can do to make yourself feel good. What? What's making yourself feel good? Now today I have a bad mood. Today I can't go to the park because I have to do a lot of homework at home. I feel really sad. I feel bad that I can't go with my friends to the park. That's a bad mood of me. And I want to cheer myself up with a calling, with a chatting, with a video chatting with my friend. I suddenly feel so happy because I've met my friends. I've talked with them for a long time, like nearly one hour. I feel so refreshed in that time. And I feel happy, and I don't feel sad anymore. I can have myself think, motivate my myself. So, inside your life, there's lots of emotions that happens, but you can see that all of them would have a negative side if you don't think them as positive. So think of them as something that is alright. Responsibility. Now think of yourself. All of your thoughts that you talk out from your brain to your mouth to the other people's ears are your ideas. It's your responsibility. If you get somebody hurt or if you say something that's wrong, it's your self. It's your self ideas. You can't just say. Oh, it's that girl's. It's that girl's fault. I'm not even guilty for a little bit. No, you can't say that because you are lying when you say those. Lying is not a good thing. So next we have. There's different words about them. Now, now we're thinking of negative. Knock negative down. Negative. Thinkings are thinkings that girls in a bad feeling. They come like make us to think about bad actions. Like today, we feel sad because we didn't finish the test. It was a really easy test. We feel so useful. We feel useless. And then we have a negative thinking that we want to leave the house just because of that. That's a negative thinking. What about positive thinking? It's a thinking that makes your brain feel good. Like maybe today I got an F on my test, but tomorrow I can try more. There's a lot of tests waiting for me, and that was not a real special test. So I'm trying to make myself happier. So as 
you can see there's lots of ways, right? Let's come to some more parts. Motivate yourself in different way. The power to control yourself was some of the best and powerful power that you can ever have in your life. Think about it. You can control yourself. You can control what you're saying. What language are you talking? What are you thinking? What are you doing? What kind of actions are you doing? You're controlling yourself. That's a great power. And motivate yourself by any way, any way that can help you. Then convert your thoughts, feelings. Convert them to questions. Like, oh, why did I feel sad today? Ooh, why did I feel happy today? But just think about those positive ones. Like, I'm happy today because my mom buys me some ice cream, and they are my favorite flavor. I thought about it. I thought, why did I feel happy about that? Then I just tell myself about what's happening. I just kind of like heard about a happy story about my life. I smiled. I cheered myself up. I have made myself feel good. Yeah. So next. So next to books. Did you ever think about books that makes you feel happy? Do you have a hobby to read books? I think that everybody has themselves the hobby of books. But they don't really recognize it. For my idea, everybody's newly, yeah, just newly in my places that live near library that have different kinds of books at their home, or have enough money to buy books or near a bookstore, they would have a really common feeling of the hobbies reading books. Like me, I am a fan of books. I really like to collect different kinds of books, even on the internet or on the paper. Like, let's see. I collect this book. This book is about something like a thing that teaches me about things. So, I like to collect a lots of kinds of books that I love. Eventually, I go into the feeling of loving books. I really love to read books from that day. I don't know what to do to help my hobbies. It was just so, 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 so good. If I can read a book that fits my style, my style is fantastic story, fiction stories, funny ones, and written by those people who are in the past. I really love them. Some science story would also accept. It would also fit my style. And what happens if you make yourself feel good? It can impact thousands of things beyond those words, those talks, those words. You can have a nice feeling about yourself, like you have done a great thing. And now, some people that would help you to motivate yourself don't always motivate them. Don't always motivate you in a right way. Sometimes when I met my best friend, she always says words that I don't really understand when she is trying to motivate me. Like I'm having a Japanese test, she will say some motivate sentences that I don't really understand her. So motivating myself was some of the best thing that I think about in that time. I think about how to motivate. What to do now? What should I put in my motivating? Think about what have I had in my day. Think of a positive thinking you would have nearly everything.